Divorce, Autumn? We just got married. I can't fucking divorce you. If you can leave me to go take care of your ex-girlfriend. Yeah, you can find the time to sign a piece of paper. It's not that hard, Mr. Fawn. Our parents will never agree to this. They don't have to know. That's the whole point. We can live in the same house, pretend like we're married. Nobody has to know anything. Marriage is not a fucking joke, Autumn. Okay, every moment that we had in that spring, that was meaningful, that meant something. It was a joke to you, Atticus. Their marriage, the spring, none of it meant anything to you. Did you see the article? You know, a scandal between two brothers over one mate. The Fonz used me as Anya's replacement because you could never get over her. Yeah, paparazzi her. That was me, crying after you abandoned me at the altar to go help Anya. When I asked for the picture of you two hugging, I don't, I don't even know when that would have happened because you did it so many times. Autumn. Oh, and the recording! Oh, might as well just go hand that to the press. If Anya hasn't already done so. I didn't know about that recording until you sent it to me, okay? That is promise. your own business. You keep in mind that I am not the one that disrespected you every step of the way, so please. Just sign the papers. Why did you take your ring off? It's not a real marriage, so... Why should I pretend to wear a ring? These fingers, these reed-like fingers, these fingers that you have, I could rip them off and it snap! You do not own my body! And you do not own my soul. We are two equal beings standing at Moon Goddess's altar. You may have had my heart, but my soul is going to follow the moon's guidance, okay? I can't do- Watch on Shore TV.